Nowadays in India greenhouse cultivation and production is gaining popularity. Greenhouse cultivation yields bumper harvesting superior quality round thief. Now let us see the cultivation of tomatoes and capsicum in greenhouse. Different types of greenhouses built in steel tubes, wooden poles and bamboos and stone pillars can be used for the cultivation of greenhouse. Capsicum and tomato hybrids with indeterminate growth habit are grown in greenhouse. To start with, the soil is loosened by digging or plowing. Beds of 100 cm wide, 15 cm high are prepared leaving 15 cm walking space between the beds. Well decomposed organic manure is added to the beds at the rate of one basket per square meter and, and mixed thoroughly. The beds are drenched thoroughly with 4% formaldehyde solution at the rate of 4 liters per square meter. The beds are covered with polythene sheet for 3 to 4 days so that the fumes do not escape. And the ventilators are closed for effective fumigation. The polythene sheet is removed after 3 to 4 days of fumigation and the beds are raked repeatedly for 4 to 5 days and the ventilators are kept open to, e to exhale the formaldehyde fumes complete. The mixture of neem cake and trichoderma solution is added at the rate of 200 gram per square meter and mixed well. A basal dose of nitrogen, phosphorus and potash at the rate of 5 grams each per square meter that is 50 kg of nitrogen, 50 kg of potash and 50 kg of phosphorus per hectare. An inline drip platinum having an emission at 30 cm interval is placed in the center of the bed. Each emission point is checked for discharge at 2 liters of water per hour. Poles are made on the mulch fur and for capsicum the distance between the rows is 45 cm and distance between the plants is 30 cm. The beds are covered with plastic mulch sheet securing the edges to check regrowth and conserve moisture. Seedlings of capsicum and, and tomatoes are grown in specially made trays. The seedling trays are sprayed with imidacloprid at the rate of 0.3 ml per liter one day before planting. On the day of planting, the trays are drenched with carbon densum at the rate of 1 gram per liter. Seedlings are planted at the center of the hole so that the plant or the seedling does not touch the mulch sheet.
beds are watered with a rose can immediately after planting and every day till the plant gets established. The fogger is run if the humidity is low in the greenhouse. If the vitality of the seedlings is noticed, the beds are drenched with copsy oxychloride at the rate of 3 grams per litre. Capsicum plants are groomed to 4 plants. Growing tip of the capsicum plant divides into two stems on fifth and sixth node. These two main branches divide into each making a total of four branches per plant which are maintained throughout the crop growth. All flowers are removed after one month after planting. And only one fruit is maintained at each node. Tomato plants are groomed to two stems per plant. The supporting wires are tied from the GI wide grid provided by the purpose at 3 meter height. Nylon wires are tied for capsicum and plastic tubes are tied for tomato plants. Each stem is tied around the plastic tube with the GI wire stream. Lowering to a tomato at the working height starts from 75 to 90 days after planting. Thank you.